The common loon, Gavia immer, is a large, long-bodied bird that is nearly three feet in length from bill tip to tail end. It is our most commonly seen loon species in North America. Loons have a spear-like bill used to strike at and grasp fish and other food items. Loons are superbly adapted to life on and under the water. Their powerful legs are placed so far back on their body that they cannot walk on land, an inconvenience which is compensated for by the diving ability it gives them. When they dive underwater in pursuit of fish, common loons may remain underwater for 30 seconds or longer. In summer, common loons nest on large lakes and ponds across the northern tier of North America, and it's during this season that the loon wears its bold black and white breeding plumage. The bird's back is a checkerboard pattern of white spots on a black background. The bright red eye stands out on the dark green, almost black head. Its striking appearance, association with the Great North, and perhaps most of all, its wailing, yodeling call have made the loon a symbol of wilderness. Let's listen to the summer voice of the common loon. Common loons also have a call that sounds like the maniacal laughing of a lunatic. While only those birders who live in the north are likely to see and hear common loons in the summer, the rest of us commonly encounter them during spring and fall migration and in winter, which loons spend on both ocean coasts, along large rivers, and on deep lakes and reservoirs. It's important to note that the winter or non-breeding plumaged loons are visually quite different from their summer selves. A common loon in winter is dark gray above and whitish below with only a broken necklace remaining from the bolder breeding plumage. The bill, which is black during the breeding season, is pale gray in winter. A common loon swimming on the water's surface shows a low profile, like a partially submerged submarine. The head is large and the bill is straight and stout. You might confuse a swimming common loon with the ubiquitous double-crested cormorant, but note the cormorant's smaller head and thinner bill which is usually pointed upward. Being larger birds, common loons fly more slowly than most ducks. Their flight shape is heavy looking and hunchbacked, showing the heavy neck, head, and bill in front and the long legs and webbed feet trailing behind. Unlike other loon species and most ducks, common loons fly very high when migrating. In the wild, common loons are not as common as they once were. Loss of habitat, encroaching development and human activity, increased predation, and the effects of acid rain and climate change have reduced the species' reproductive success. The common loon's special appeal has resulted in the formation of loon conservation groups, often punningly called loon rangers, dedicated to protecting loons and to increasing their population. One place this species is still very common, however, is in the soundtracks to movies and TV shows. The common loon's maniacal laughing cries can be heard in almost any scene that needs some wilderness sound effects, including in many settings where a loon would never be found. Many birders enjoy identifying these out-of-place loons. Of course, it's much more satisfying to hear a loon calling in its natural setting, something many birders feel is one of the quintessential experiences of their hobby. <laughs>